The working principle of electrical transformers, how does the transformer step up and step down voltage? Pay attention. The core component inside the transformer is the electromagnetic induction coil. Its principle is similar to wireless charging. The coils are the primary winding on the left and secondary winding on the right. When the primary winding is energized, an induced electromotive force is generated in the secondary winding. By changing the number of turns of the windings, you can control the output voltage of the secondary winding. This achieves stepping up and down the voltage. Because three-phase power is used, there are three windings in the transformer. The windings are placed in a tank, and the tank is filled with oil. The oil provides cooling and insulation for the transformer. To ensure the windings do not touch the shell, bushings are installed on the high and low voltage sides. They are insulators made of ceramic. Large radiators are mounted on the sides. Inside, there are thin plates with gaps for air circulation. When the transformer is fully loaded, the windings start to heat up. The oil also heats up and is cooled by the radiators. There are large fans on the radiators for cooling. When the transformer overheats, the fans automatically start running. An oil storage tank is installed at the top. The tank is only half filled with oil because when fully loaded, the oil expands due to heating up. Sometimes overloading causes bubbles to form in the oil. The bubbles introduce gas into the transformer, increasing the pressure inside the tank. So between the tanks, a gas relay is installed. It contains a tilted tube filled with the conductive metal mercury. The tank pressure increases, creating gas inside the tank. The gas enters the relay, and the oil inside gradually decreases. Due to this pressure, the float installed here also starts to extend. The mercury connects the float to the contacts, triggering a loud alarm. For safety, there is also a float installed at the bottom. It will trigger an alarm when the oil level continues to drop. If both floats fail, there is also an explosion-proof vent at the top of the tank. Transformers are typically used to step up the voltage at power plants, then to your house. Transformers are very expensive and dangerous, so remember not to steal oil from them. If you enjoy this video, then hit like button and follow for more 3D animation videos.